Whoa, hope you're doing good today uh, with everything that's going on. Hope you have plenty of toilet paper because I know a lot of people out there, well, because of some people out there that took truckloads, a lot of us are having to ration. Anyway, today I got a product that was sent to me by the company ACVCY. These are the emergency sleeping bags. Now, even though they were provided to me free of charge, my review is mine, my own words, and it's an honest opinion of what I think of it. So we'll be getting into that coming right up. Okay, well, let's take a look at what we got in here. Now it comes in a double two pack, double pack, two pack, whatever. Uh, do you remember a while back I did a, a video on some space blankets? And I was really curious if I was able to get it back in the bag, which I did, which is unusual because I thought for sure it wouldn't go back in the bag. Anyway, let me. Uh, now, I don't deal in grams. I mean, that didn't come out right. Um, I don't work in grams. I work, oops, in uh, ounces. Okay, let's see. That sounded strange. I don't work in grams. Uh, anyway, um, let's see. What is it? 4.27 ounces. Now I forgot where I let off. But anyway, uh, I was quite surprised I was able to get that blanket back in that pouch. Let's hope I can get the sleeping bag back in there. Let me uh, give you a little bit of information here. Uh, ACVCY, emergency sleeping bag, perfect for emergency situations where warmth is... Okay, but... Uh, Net weight 4.1 ounce. Well, a little bit more than that, but um, you can store this blanket almost anywhere because it comes rolled up inside of a waterproof waterproof bag. Now, once this is gone, you have a nice little waterproof bag to put stuff in. Of course, it's not waterproof. The material might be, but the opening's not. Anyway. Um, well, I'll tell you what, let me uh, put a screenshot of this down here for you. You can read it down here. Um, let's see, comes in a two pack. Let me see, sleeping bag measures 80 by 47 inches. So, anyway, let's uh, take a look at this. I'm trying to find the end here. Yeah, it's the same thickness as you would expect. The same as the, uh, the blankets. It's got the uh, vibrant orange on the outside and the mylar silver on the inside. Or if you happen to be somewhere where it's too hot, 
you can actually reverse this it'll still hold in the heat but it'll reflect excess so if you're somewhere where it's really hot you might be cooler turning this inside out and climbing in it and reflecting the heat away from you so let's see wow uh, I'm not sure what 80 inches is but it's tall um, let me move this camera around let me move this camera around so I can get a bigger shot you'll see all my junk I got piled up around here I'm either working on videos or have worked on videos and haven't put stuff away so let me get right back to you so I can get this camera back a little farther so you can get a better shot okay well it's touching the floor and it's a good two feet above my head so let's uh let's open this thing up now as people can tell i'm uh what's the word large girthy <laughs> let's open this thing all the way up i kept my house clothes on for you people that aren't so technically in savvy house clothes means pajamas <laughs> for me anyway so let's see how well I fit in this okay This is going to take a little here. This thing's pretty, pretty long. Okay, my feet are at the bottom of it. And it's got plenty of room to move your legs around. If you're one of the people like me would move your legs around during the night and stuff, now this will probably wake you up. Okay. Wow. I'm really surprised. It fits me in there, plus room. Now, as most of you know, this is plastic. You don't want to leave your kids unattended in this, and you don't want to cover your face up, okay? For one, this is gonna get moisture inside just from your body sweating. Even though you don't feel the sweat, it will and then you'll have moisture in here and you'll get your clothes wet then when you climb out of this you'll be even colder because your clothes will be wet so you will want to air this out once in a while during the night but as you can see it does cover me up pretty darn well um and i can feel i can feel the warmth so i am going to take it off but it is a little bit on the warm side even though it's cloudy out uh, and like I said I still have my pajamas on which are sweats so. um, I give this two thumbs up because uh, any emergency blanket in the emergency is going to be handy now let's see the true test if you could pull this thing back up I'll probably fast forward this because it'll take me a while. So, let's see. No. Well, I'm definitely gonna have to take this, lay it out on the floor, get down on my hands and knees, and roll it up. I'm sure I can get it back in here if I took my time. But I know you people, your time's valuable too. 
and you don't really want to sit there and watch me try to roll this thing up, I don't think. But I do believe if you hold it up, remember to roll from the foot end first so it gets all the air out of there. But anyway, um, I put it on, or I should say I got in it. Uh, it didn't rip on me. And it looks like the seams, they put a, a, a plastic tape on the seams and it, it seems to be a very strong tape that they used. It's not like a, uh, a just a cellophane tape, it's a little bit heavier duty plastic type tape. But I'm going to give them a two thumbs up because I felt the warmth in it. I know how Mylar works. I've been around it before put it on and stuff and use the mylar blanket once when it was cold out so uh yeah two thumbs up we might be able to get out there today and do the second half of the zippo fire starter uh video for you it's nice it's warm the wind's not blowing and it ain't raining so Anyway, till next time, please, if you haven't subscribed, go down, hit that subscribe button, click that little bell icon, that way you'll be notified next time we upload a video. Over here, I'll put a couple of videos that you might like to watch, and right there on my smiling face, I don't think I was smiling in that picture, I might have to change that, but you can click on that to subscribe as well as click in the bar down below. So until next time. Stay prepared.